We found a 50-year-old Volkswagen Beetle underwater, and today we're going to remove it with our tow truck. Try looking at a Volkswagen this way. It's the only small car with a sealed steel bottom built to take a little punishment. Oh my God, it's so cold. <laughs> I couldn't think straight. Yeah, the VW is so well put together, it's practically airtight. After years being underwater, we found this old Volkswagen Beetle. This is insane. What other car gives you this kind of quality, kind of price? I'm Adam Brown. And I'm Jeremy, a.k.a. Nug. We search the rivers and lakes across America for wrecked vehicles underwater. You wouldn't know it by just looking, but there's thousands out there, and everyone tells a story. Insurance fraud, stolen, accidents. It's our mission to search for the missing, find vehicles, and remove them from harming our environment. This is Wrecked and Recovered. Man, my beard's looking amazing. You jealous? Oh, you, je you jealous? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Maybe. I, Listen, no. I, I've worked months for this peach fuzz. What are you talking about, dude? I shaved. This rat nest on my face. I shaved two days ago. Well, <laughs> you're, you're ugly. How dare you? <laughs> I'm an I'm not, angel. I'm not jealous of your beard at all. I'm beautiful. Man. I'm jealous that you have, like, a lot less gray. You know, some of us aren't blessed in that way, but. We're blessed in other ways, I'm, like I'm I, just, my height, you know. I'm blessed to be here in this beautiful river we're fixing to go dive in. I know, in. Back, back in your favorite place in the world, Oak Ridge. Oak Ridge, Tennessee. You know, we've been here before. I found a missing woman here. You did? We found a bunch of cars. Yep. There's a car like right there, actually, we're driving by. Yeah, there's old GTO sitting here. There's uh -huh. another one way down there. But we're going after a Volkswagen. What? Did get, you strike me? Get it? Punch buddy. Man. <laughs> He punched me. I can't believe that. Yeah, I was, I was being. <coughs> oh, I get weak, it. Weak punch. You're supposed to see the bug before you do a slug bug. I see it coming out of the water now. I don't even know what color. Oh, wasn't it red? I think it was red. I think it was pink, but you know. No, no, just, we'll go with red. Let's check. It could be pink. We'll say but, pink. Yeah. I'm like, excited. The water looks amazing. It's definitely green. Like this water, man. I mean, we've only dove here once and the water wasn't clear. Yeah. You did, actually. And you still managed to recover a vehicle. We did. We got so. an amazing vehicle. And we actually made it in the Rolling Stones magazine, which was really cool. It was pretty cool. You should, like, you should, you should throw, throw up a picture. You should throw a picture. Bam. Um, so, we got a crazy video for today. Mm. Let's get out of this river. Check it out. Okay. Just to go, like, woo. I said, okay. <laughs> <laughs> woo. <laughs> Back in Oak Ridge. Man, Man look at this river. It's getting warm. It's beautiful. Quick, yeah. I know, right? Choo, 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 choo. Stop, uh, stop beating me. It's Tennessee law. Man, it's beautiful. Hot. You know, it's hotter than I expected it today. It was a nice morning, but now it's hot. I bet it's going to feel good in the water. We feel real good. Nice, nice high 70s, maybe. I don't know. Uh oh. There's a tiny bit of a current moving now. That's the same as it was. You know what? I'm going to give you some of this. It looks like a, a, a hair more than it was. I don't think so. I don't think so. We better, I we better get moving quick. So. We want to get this Volkswagen Beetle out the river. No. No. We this, got all day. This water looks so clear, though. It is clear. It's so clear. I might never come up. Oh. I'm, I'll become a, a merman. Oh, look at fishy. So you can tell, like, all this, this growth. This yeah. thing ain't moved in months. It's been, a, it's been a minute. It's been a pretty minute, but you know what? Not much growth. I think we should see what's under the water. I know, right? Let's get the boat in the water, see what happens. And you never know, there might be a new fresh car right here. It could be. And then we'll just pull that one out first. Yeah. We'll make life easier. Right. Well, there's a lot of cars out here we're gonna get to one day. One day. So let's we'll get start, the boat in. We'll start with that beetle. Start and, with the beetle. And then we'll get the boat in. Sounds good. <laughs> That'll get. Oh, hi. Hi. What you doing? Well, you know, I'm just, oh, oh God. <laughs> I'm just sitting here. Oh. <laughs> the 
boat started sliding when I stepped on it. Tire. There's two tires. A tire. There's a tur. A tur. No fresh vehicles. Oh, look like it. There's a couple tires, a little box down there. I mean, that's good to know. Big old tree trunk. I mean, it's good, but it's not. It'd be cool if there was one. <laughs> It'd be easier. Be like, yes! New cars are fun to pull out. They're not filled with mud. Man, I feel like, I feel like I belong here. I've been to Oak Ridge so much. Pulled numerous cars out. Found a missing person. Saved a dog. I made that last part up. Oh yeah. But you never know. There could be kittens floating around out here in a bag. A disgruntled fisherman. He uses, <laughs> he uses live kittens as bait. Tries everything. It's hardcore. Are you listening to me? I try not to. Oh. Down here at the spot, right below this bridge, actually there's a pillar right over there. Well, lucky days, it's still there. It's still there? It's still there, still upside down, looking pretty. Man, look Dude, at- Dare I say, I wonder if that's Oh, something. you know what, there was another thing that we were looking at. That's it, got a round spot, I don't know. If it's there's two beetles? I don't know if it's small. What if somebody dumped two Volkswagen bugs right here? That'd be awesome. There was something like right over there, I remember searching, that we were like, uh, I think that's a car. That might be a car. Dad, even a, well, that's a bug. That's a lot bigger than the wheels, at least. But go over here, because I think there was something right there. But we got the bug, so we're going to get this one out. The conditions are good. Conditions. Just got a little, little, little sissy over here. Man, I, I, I will not be able to do it. I'll tell you, <laughs> I'll hit that water. You'll um, shrivel up. It's It's been a long time since I had to suffer like that. It's not like you need to have more kids. <laughs> Still. I'd like to go home to them. <laughs> like an ice cube. All right, so we got these big old magnets here. As always, we're going to stick to this car. We're going to stick it real good. And uh, make it super easy for Jeremy since he's diving again. Since I, like I, that. I keep getting ear infections. Yeah, I get to dive in this super Better clear, amazing water. My totally real ear infections. Oh, <laughs> wink, wink. Oh, you didn't hear that, right? No, I heard it. Should be right around here. We'll see about that, mister. Oh, looky there, we got it. Nailed it. First try. Sort of, sort of, kind of, sort of. Man, that was easy as apple pie. So, right there is the buoy. You can almost see the car. I'm excited to see this come out. It was, was it red? Remember, I thought it was white. Time for a sexy, sexy sizzle. montage. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you're getting your suit on. Is the magnet on like solid? It's pretty Actually. good, yeah. Is your, air, is your air on? I'm not pretty sure. All right, so um, are you gonna hook it up sideways or what do you get? What you, what's your plan? I'm gonna here? hook it on one side. Let's float it sideways. Okay. <laughs> Quick and easy. All right, I'll get the bag for you if you want to get in the water. Okay. Okie dokie. Get down in there. Wow, that's cold. Oh yeah? Oh God. Are you feeling it? Oh God. I don't even want to touch the water. I'm so freezing. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> you got a leak? No. <laughs> you can see how close we are to this bridge. Definitely a bit of potential hazard. Nothing near bri a bridge is safe. Yeah, potential. <laughs> I mean, it's been here for a while and not caused it. You know what I mean, though. This bridge is coming down. Yeah. <laughs> I'm hoping though one airbag will float it. It's a small, I don't know the weight of a beetle, but I feel like two dudes could like tip over a beetle. Got the hose hooked up there. 
Yep. Jeremy's in the water right there. This really should be a pretty quick recovery because it's a small car, it's upside down, so there's a lot to hook to. I mean, it's easy to just hook on the something down there on the tires and the axles. is right there basically what we think happened is there's a road right there now it's a like a long walking trail but there's kind of i think it might have been an old boat ramp or something but you could drive down it before and so i think it got dumped in right there and just floated right down here could have came off the bridge but that seems like an easier <laughs> explanation <laughs> Man, was it was it cold? That was terrifying. You loved it. Oh my God, it's so cold. <laughs> I couldn't think straight. Oh, <laughs> if this doesn't work, man, I, I, mm, I don't know if I can do it. Maybe if I put that hoodie on. It's thermal, it's, I, it's bitter ice cold. <laughs> and I landed like, I went down so fast, I was I couldn't stop myself from, from going. Yeah. And I watched the rope and I looked down, and I was like, well, I could see everything. And so I hit the bottom, I could see the car sitting there and I was like, man, and I mean, I'm just like, instant. I'm like. <gasps> that might've been the fastest hookup that you've ever done. Oh, I, I could have done it faster if I was warm. Because <laughs> I landed beside the car, so I'd like walk over to the car. And then the bag was like, so I had to drag the bag up on top of the car. And I stirred up all the crap so I could barely see what I was doing. And then I uh, didn't even need a light. There's no point. I was like, oh, I don't need a light. Yeah. I got it hooked under, I guess it's, I don't know what it is, but I got it hooked under one side. So it either floats or it's going to break. I hope it doesn't break. Let's see. But there's like, there's none of this car showing. It's all muscles. Really? Yeah. It's like, oh, it's like, geez, this car. It's, it's probably well preserved. Yeah. There's nothing but muscles. We're going to have to get a scraper and like, uh, uh. Oh, man. All right, let's see if she floats. All right, so what we're going to do here is hook this one on to this guy. A few moments later. Man, look at that, we got her with one bag. Man, you're my hero, everybody tell you that? No. I want to be just like you. So we got us a bug. See now we just gotta go up two miles up the river. Yeah, now this the long, long journey. Did the magnet come off? Uh, yeah. Actually, I'll do the magnet on. Really? When I hit the ground, I was next to the corner. Oh. Yeah, we don't wanna forget that. All right. I'll see my bubbles. I think we're good. <laughs> you can see the car right there. That's so crazy. Coolest thing you've ever seen. It is a cool thing. That thing's covered in zebra mussels. You can't see the car at all. 
Put it right in that hole, man. You got it. Good. almost like we've done this before it's 12 50 right now let's just say one let's see how long it takes us to get back <laughs> oh god dude that thing's sweet <laughs> oh, uh... just go go that way go hard up oh. it doesn't it doesn't work that way bro all right so i'm so excited we got we got it good job man oh you know none of the days so what are, you, what are your thoughts here my thoughts are... How fast are we going? <laughs> oh, dude, half a mile an hour. Well, you know, if we had like a 150 on this boat. All right, it has been, uh, I think, two hours. Uh, There's the bridge. We're going 0.64 miles an hour. How does that make you feel? Man, I'll tell you what, I am incredibly bored. All right, we'll keep you updated in another two hours. <laughs>
Whatever you want. Back down. All right. You want me to go do that? You're the one that has it insured, so. Uh, what's, uh, what's insurance? What is that? What's that? What is that? <laughs> Tell me what's going on. Well, I'm gonna lock all this stuff together and I'm just guessing all this together should reach the car. I'll be able to pull it in enough to put the put the, put the wrecker all the way up there. Yeah. And then we could drag the rest of the way, flip it, and drag it up here, clean it out, see what we're looking at. I concur. I like your concurrence. So you're gonna like not you're gonna just try to stand on the car out there and hook I'm it on? Try. Freeze to death again. Put a little mask on. Yeah. Probably feel good. I don't know my mask. I think there should be a mask in there. Uh, Alright. It should feel good. Are you crazy? <laughs> I'm still gonna freeze to death. Look at that dog. Who's that dog? Alright. You ready? Hurry up, people are waiting. Man, let me tell you something, all right? People are hungry. I'm tired now. You look, three, you look tired. Three hours of doing nothing, one mile an hour. That's crazy. What the hell are we doing out here? I don't know. Then we're gonna do it again tomorrow. Having fun. We gotta get all of this pulled out. Be able to reach. <laughs> Man, it's slick. I'm still going. You still going? Alright, so I'm taking us back. Hey, Jeremy. See if it even reaches. Like this. So the low end on that side. Make sense? So this might. Might work. Let's see. Might work? Yeah. Well, it has to work. It's always like right there and arms like away, like it's so close. It's kind of annoying. Let me guess. This is all we got. Uh. No, I think you can pull on it a little. Well, pull on it. What am I doing? I can't reach it. That's all there's to it. There's not enough line. Do we have any line on the boat? What about that J-hook? A J-hook on a J-hook? Or we have that extension. All right, hold your breath. <sighs> that was easy. Might as well be diving naked. That is so flipping cold. <laughs> oh my goodness. So the question is, does that reach this? Yes. So now what? Well, so we gotta tie keep, it on. I want to keep it tight. So let it go. Maybe we can gently pull ourselves back with that line. Keep it tight. What? Hey, this, I hate about this platform, it's not level. You slide off and be careful. Hey, where are you going? I don't know, it's like we're not going anywhere. I'm holding really tight. Oh. So you need to just keep pulling. I'm keeping like, I'm holding this thing pretty snug. So you're gonna put some ass behind it. That's about clear as could be though. I went down, I was like, good man, you can see the ground, see the car. Oh, sweet. How are you gonna get out? Uh that's a great question. It's gonna scratch up the damn cab juicer. I'm gonna, pull, I'm gonna pull the boat sideways. Okay. Maybe.
Ooh. Oh god, I can't feel anything. Hopefully it keeps tension. That's moving. Well, it's gonna move. Where'd you put it around the tire? Same thing. Like it. I think, I think, I'm not sure. The car might have just righted itself for us. Flipped on its wheels. Yeah, I mean, it was sitting like this. I mean, with the, with the undercarriage faces, so it's a good chance it could have flipped over. I think you might be right. I hope so, I don't want to destroy it till we get out of the water. Anybody ever tell you you look like a penguin? Only, only from the belly down. <laughs> Hung up? It's like hung up. It's like a small ledge right there. Alright, so Jeremy's out there standing on it. Let's I'll take the hook off. You put it on the back. And take the hook off and loosen it. I'm gonna pull it this way. I'm gonna hook it on the rear tire and pull it this way, and then it'll fall on its wheels. And then we can drag it out. It's on its side right now, like facing this way. So it's literally on the side. So. Well, we got this beetle out of the water almost. Jeremy's standing on it out there. It's right there. I guess we got to uh, change it a little bit. That bag is almost out of the water. All right, so Jeremy's got it right there. I don't think it's uh, rolling though, but we're gonna get rid of this black strap. Did it bring it to me? Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> Don't, don't mess up in front of all these people. You're know, right? falling in your face. I've got a audience. <laughs> Check it out guys, after years being underwater, we found this old Volkswagen Beetle. This is insane. It's about to come out of the water. Right here in uh, Oak Ridge, Tennessee. Look at that. Dang. That thing is covered in muscles. It's so small, it's so tiny. Look at that thing, man, it's old. One more time. What? Oh, did they hear it? Yeah, All right. All right, so Jeremy's getting that magnet rope. This thing looks crazy. We're about to finish pulling it out here in just a second. First ever bug that we pulled out. All right, let's pull. Oh, okay. Well, we'll pull it up a little bit more and then I'll pull up. Okay. We'll take it out. Tight? Yeah. 
You need the pliers? That's fine. You need these? Not on the bag, but the, it's wrapped up. What are you going to do? Pull it out. Might be able to drive it out. That is awesome. Wow. It's not on the bag, is it? Gosh. That's crazy. The Volkswagen Beetle's iconic rounded shape and rear engine design has remained largely unchanged for decades. It was known as the people's car for being affordable and practical to own. Its popularity extends beyond its German roots, making appearances in various movies and TV shows. The Beetle was discontinued in 2019, but still has a dedicated community of enthusiasts and collectors. Yeah. Is it, is it engaged? Do you got it in low? Yeah. So it's a problem. It's too steep. Don't be steep. You can still crawl out of this thing. It's acting like it's stuck. It's not moving. The parking brake's jammed or something, isn't it? Might be jammed. It's up. <laughs> Blocked up. What the hell? <laughs> I don't know. It's not going. That's in low. The brake's gone. The brake fluid. No, it's not the clutch. It's that the brake's the middle pedal. Yeah, the brake's going out. I'm, I'm. Yeah, that's a that's a better bad. That's a better thing. I guess grab one of the J hooks. We're just hooking on the front. All right. Never a dull day. Well, if the brake fluid runs out in the truck. Does it lock? I have no idea. <laughs> We're gonna have to use Jeremy's truck to pull ours up or see if it pulls up. I don't know if it's something. Oh yeah. Yeah, look. It's something to do with that brake line, dude. It's leaking right there. Yeah, we were having some issue right here. Look at that. It's not good. So we're kind of on the lift bag right here. We're trying to save it. What's, yeah. the, what's the problem? It's on the bag. Probably save it with a, with a flat bit. What do you think? What do you think, bro? Yeah, we just wait here, right? We don't need to go up more, do we? No, we're good here. Okay. We can figure that shit out. Get that out of it. How is it? Are you... The back one, you can probably get out. We can take that off. Yeah, but the front one is sitting on the dam. Well, let's take that one off first. Man, we just got this bug out of the water. Tow guy's here. 
Mike's got to take it. Let's look inside real quick, though. We're having issues with our tow truck, so we don't really have a lot of time. Let's take a look inside. Well, now, I'm glad you have to touch because we can definitely use it to clean the boat. Dang. I wanted to hose it out on the inside just to, because you just never know. But Any idea on this one? I, we have the tag before. Yeah. I've dove it before to get the tag off it. Yeah. And I mean, it was so old, there's no record of this thing. I think it's just over here. Man, look at that. That's, that might be worth something. It might be. Oh, it's well, it's better than being trapped under the wheel. Kind of, yeah. I think you're going to have to lift it up. I don't think it's on the bag. It's just all wrapped up in there underneath it. Man, that is crazy. This thing used to be red here. It's a pretty little car. So we got this car out. You shout out the quality towing. They always help us out. So if you guys want to help them out, you can go give them, leave them a good review. Check out their Facebook page, Google review. Leave a comment. Whatever you guys want to do, let them know that we appreciate their help. But uh, another car successfully out of the river. This is number 18, I believe, or 19. So that's awesome. Shout out quality to one. All right, man, it is the next day, clearly. What are you talking about? It's uh, it, it may be a whole week later. We might even be in a different state. <laughs> we might be. I don't know. Man, it looks different around here. Um, but you know what? The important thing is we got this beetle out of the water. That was our first beetle. That thing's awesome. We kind of like, it took so long to get it to the ramp. And then once we got it there, you called two. Quality towing is just too good, man. They were too fast. Yeah, they showed up way too fast. <laughs> so we got to remember next time when we go there to pull a car out, which we have another one. We're gonna have to call them like, you know, once we're like actually ready for them. Yeah, because they were there in like five we're, minutes. Yeah, we're so used to sitting around waiting. Yeah, they were like there. So, yeah, kudos, but quality I mean, towing. That's our uh, first beetle. Yeah. I think some people were saying it's a super beetle, maybe? I, it, it looked dead to me. Well, hopefully we get the year right in this video, because I don't know, a lot of people were debating that. They were saying mid 70s. Yeah. So we can go sounds, with that. Sounds right. 70s is fine. Um, but we appreciate you guys watching it as always. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do that. It helps us out a ton. You know, if you want to leave a like, leave a comment, all that good stuff. Also, you can check out Exploring with Nug. If you want. What's my channel? Adam Brown Crochets. Eh, close ah, enough. They get it. They get it. <laughs> also, we have our nonprofit we started, don't we? Yeah, we have a new nonprofit. It's called Rapid Compassion Collective. Go to the website, rapidcc.org. It'll tell you all the stuff we do. Essentially, we're doing this, we're doing everything right now that the nonprofit is built on. So. We, we, we just made it official. 
So now we're we're now we're an official organization. We're moving on up in the world. We are trying to uh, do bigger and better things, and yep. uh, you guys, it's another way you guys can help us do that. So, uh, but yeah, we appreciate you watching. Hopefully, you enjoy this episode. Did you have fun? I did. Dragging a, a beetle for three hours. It was amazing. Should have brought we, a fishing line. I think Rod. we need a, a bigger boat for these type of recoveries. Well, buy me one. <laughs> Freaking out of here! All right, see you guys on the next one. Yeah. We, it's the next day and uh, we got the bug out of the water, but as you can see, we're underneath the tow truck, aren't we? Yes, sir. What, are, what is going on? What happened? Well, this mystery part that never worked to begin with decided uh, to crap out even more. Well, there's a thing called a lever lock. And essentially... Right there. That essentially, it's, it's a very complicated way to make a brake line set brake. So essentially, we had a busted brake line. Yeah. And so we're uh we're we're deleting this weird little <laughs> valve thing and we're just we're just making this a just a just a regular old tube. Yeah. That's about it. So we're hooking those two lines together. And uh yeah, you know this this tow truck's been <laughs> been lasting us a while. But uh yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it's a good time to mention we do have a GoFundMe for our dream tow truck in the future. That's a long goal. But you know, if you guys have the means to, if you wanna Shoot a dollar or a nickel our way, that'd be cool. Yeah, I wouldn't complain. But you know, uh, old Red here has been running strong. <laughs> She's leaking. <laughs>